Okay, we're going to do a review on this GA Precision Rifle. This is a Remington 700 short action. This is chambered in a 300 Winchester short magnum. It does have a Badger recoil lug, a Bartling 24 inch barrel. It is threaded 5 8 by 24. It has a Vies muzzle brake. It's been threaded and a Badger tactical bolt knob installed. The trigger is, it's been lightened, but it's not very, very light. It's three pounds, seven ounces. It has a factory Remington floor plate. This stock is a Manners A5 stock. It's uh, very, very close to the McMillan A5 stock. It has two quick detached cups on the left side of the stock. It has an adjustable butt plate that moves up and down and in and out. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and set up and install a Badger 20 Amoy mount that we normally use and a Leopold 35 by 10 by 40 objective with a mill dot reticle, some mid, mid high um, Badger rings. This is a setup that we normally use on some of our test rifles. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and assemble this, this stuff here on the rifle and we're going to take it down to the range and see what kind of groups we can get out of it. We're here at the range, the 100 yard range. Uh, we just shot some test groups with the GA Precision 300 Winchester Short Magnum. The rifle shot very, very well. Um, very, very little or no recoil at all. Because it's a Magnum charge, we thought it was going to have a big kick and a lot of recoil. But because of the Vies muzzle brake, it, uh, it made a lot, a lot of difference. It probably had a recoil about a uh, signature of a 308 or so. We have uh, two three round groups. The top group is shooting the Sierra 165 Splitzer, and it shot very well. It's probably about half an inch or so. The bottom group is a uh, three-round group shooting the 160, 168 bolt tail hollow points from Sierra. So we have. Um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do some more load development and see if we can get these uh, groups a little bit tighter. But as of now, the rifle shoots extremely, extremely well. We're very, very happy with it. So uh, we'll keep you guys updated on this. Thank you.